Here are a few items that have been on my mind since our last gathering. First, we've worked during the spring and summer to extend our West Campus lease with TJ Maxx. We moved the lease term out an additional two years to end on January 31, 2028, with rent increases over that extended term. We also traded for a special provision that allows us to terminate the TJ Maxx lease with 12 months notice and with the payment to them of not more than $100,000. The first time we may terminate the lease is January 31, 2026, with notice given at the end of 2024. This option provision is solely in our control. Under the lease, TJ Maxx is committed to the full lease term. This termination feature gives us maximum optionality. We can keep TJ Maxx as a tenant through January 2028, but we may also terminate the TJ Maxx lease if we need the space for the church's expansion on the West Campus following the results of our capital campaign. Second, as I reported to you last time, we are beginning the process to check the viability of a capital campaign. I am pleased to report that we are approaching this capital campaign project with prayerful deliberation. More on this to come as the plan develops. And then finally, a word about discipleship. I urge each of you to become more involved in our life and work. As we enter the new school year, an excellent path to full discipleship is to invest in yourself through Bible study, small group involvement, Sunday school, and in volunteer and mission opportunities. Continue to join us in worship, but give yourself the gift of a second hour of involvement, or even more, to expand your understanding of the Word and to engage with others to expand God's kingdom. Thanks for listening.